Why ducks? It started off as a joke. Um, they did a duck hunt here in like October and it was mid, mid to late fall. Uh, there was a campus-wide duck hunt where they would hide these colored ducks um, in various offices and around campus and uh, the students were supposed to go find these ducks and collect points basically. I wanted to add some more spice to it and I thought why not continue it? Rubber ducks, there's something very childlike within them. There's something very playful. Everyone has some kind of memory towards ducks, even if they don't have one. That aspect of hiding some ducks around places and having people have a little bit of joy. It's very stressful work at times, so why not? And college can be really stressful for someone to find a duck in a weird place. Well, that can bring a little bit of joy. We always try to have things that are like this active engagement. You sign up, you attend the class, you go to this event. Well, this isn't that. People go around and they find these ducks in our lobby. They find these ducks around campus and then they've actually in turn started to hide them themselves. I wouldn't have expected it to go as far, um, but it has. People have engaged in a different level. It might be like a two minute or three minute engagement. Hey, there's a duck over there. Hey, there's this thing. But students buy into it because it's something small that breaks up the monotony of studying going to class. I think it's also amusing for my peers, and supervisors, and um, student affairs professionals uh, in the department as well, but it's, it's for the students. I've been taking to hiding like really tiny ducks in the bottom of like pen holders. They're like tucked in like ceiling tiles places. There's one in a vent, just unusual places. How did these ducks get there? I mean, it's a, it's a rubber duck, like what's, there's just something about like a novel item of a rubber duck that who can't not like this? Then people will be like, why is there a duck behind this TV? Well, I didn't, I didn't even place it there. Someone else did. So it's, it's fueled into something else. So like it didn't need to be a duck. It was just the thing that was the method for this engagement. Some, some of the ducks I bought, the really, really tiny ones, were given to me as a gift. The ones with the hats, I actually found in a box in our storage space for Res Life. Whole box of ducks, which just like fueled this even more. Like hundreds and hundreds of ducks became available. Now my supervisors and central staff are like embracing them and talking about them in like public meetings. So like it's grown on them too. We all have an opportunity to do something with very, very little things. So like a duck can bring someone joy just as much as really anything. Because sometimes you can't always be present, you can't always be there, but can you find a way for people to engage and find joy or happiness in something as, as small as a rubber duck? <laughs>